you can have it all. In the Nokia 6600 phone, vision becomes reality. Nokia, connecting people. Wow, what a device. From, from today's perspective, doesn't this look kind of antique already? Like it's a big device, big, uh, big buttons, small screen. But this was in 2003. So 10 years ago, already these guys kind of offering a device. And what was the specialty here? Well, we kind of see the guy at the airport checking in. He's kind of astonishing the security guards by actually having a device that offers more than being just a phone. It actually integrates previously distinct technological applications, right? We have kind of this, the cell phone on the one hand. We have the, the our personal organizer. We have email. We have a, we have a watch. We have a, uh, an address book. Basically, uh, integrating previously distinct devices into, into one machine. OK. 2003, 10 years ago. This device has been out there for, for quite a while. Now, let's have a look at another example and see what actually happened then uh, four years later, if we go back to 2007. And uh, probably now you might guess what might be coming. An iPod, a phone, <laughs> and an internet communicator. An iPod, <laughs> a phone. Are you getting it? These are not three separate devices. This is one device. And we are calling it iPhone. Today, today Apple is going to reinvent the phone. OK, so 2007 reinventing the phone. Now, this was four years later than the previous example we saw. So kind of a similar idea, right? This, in a way, if we compare these side by side, the idea here of combining previously, diff diff uh, previously different applications into one doesn't seem that new. But why are these guys claiming that they are reinventing the phone? 2007 claiming they are reinventing the phone. So some kind of difference needs to be there between these two examples. Let's go on with a couple of more examples, because I think, you know, whereas uh, IT and telecom, uh, mobile and fixed net is kind of the, one of the most prevalent examples of convergence, this is actually the only one. There are several other streams of convergence if we look around us. So just to, to mention a few here, um, we can talk about also, you know, the convergence between optical